is my city and I love it. Yeah, I love it. I was born and raised. Uh, next, we want to bring up uh, school board president who, uh, and as you know, Richard has talked a lot with regards to our schools and how our schools need to be the best that they can be. And one person who has worked diligently along with us school board members who's really put a lot into it is the next person who's going to come up and speak with us this morning, that is Ms. Annette Johnson. Well, I'm here to support Richard today, um, and also my other board members as well want to support Richard, Kim Hatchett, and Ken Darby and Alex Arroyo are all supporting him as well. But we want to support our fellow Tomcat, um, Richard. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Richard's had a tremendous story to tell. And, you know, I think in these days where, you know, the state or the federal government and fixing those types of things seem to be daunting, I think the best we can do is get somebody in our local office that cares about our community, that has been in our community, that chose to go to the military, that chose to come back to our community, that chose to open a small business. And as a small business owner myself, I can honestly say, it gives you a whole different skill set to make payroll for your employees to worry about if your employees are going to have health insurance, things like that. Richard has those skill sets. He tells us an incredible story. And most importantly, he is a great role model for our children. All of the children of Aurora need a role model in the mayor's office, like Richard Irvin. Richard Irvin comes out of you know, he has talked about it himself. He comes out of great poverty, but he went on to school. He shows kids the importance of what you can, you can be and what you can become. And that's the most important thing, is that we all live our lives as role models for, for the children of Aurora. And it's important that we elect the next mayor to be that role model for our children. So I wish my fellow Tomcat well, and <laughs> remind everybody to go out and vote on April 4th. Thank you. And I love it. Yeah, I love it.